So we want to send it over to our Kasha Grigorchik. She spoke with people in the North County who are gathering supplies ahead of Hurricane Hillary. Kasha. Hey, good evening, Kathleen. And really, Jamie touched on a lot of the really good preparation tips. A lot of people here in Escondido heeding a lot of those warnings. We saw people picking up sandbags, putting gas in their car, preparing their homes. And as we spoke to a lot of these people, they say as the week has reached the end, uh, they're really taking it a little more seriously. And as Hillary gets closer. Skeptical like most people. I was like, because we always hear about weather and rain, and we never see it. So I was like, yeah, right. But then I saw, you know, some of um, uh, meteorologists you know, with images of the storm. And so like, well, this seems like a pretty serious, lots of red. Vincenzo Roma is one of many Escondido residents really beginning to take preparation for Hurricane Hillary seriously. Got to help her. Our region now under a tropical storm warning, which is a first for Southern California. And with all the rains we had, yeah, we did. We had a lot of people complain about erosion. And, and we saw a lot of trees down and everything. So I think everyone's already thinking about, I hear people talking about sharpen your chainsaws, like kind of have your generators. So I think everyone's kind of has a more prepared mindset. Cal Fire in Escondido tells Fox 5 the phone has been ringing all day with people asking how to prepare and if sandbags are still available. Uh, Each household can take up to 25 bags, and for now, Cal Fire still has them. Local gas stations were also busy with people making sure they had a full tank or bringing home extra fuel. Getting gas for the generators at home, getting the uh, canopies taken down at home. They're made out of wood in case they fall down on the cars. The local Home Depot was also a busy spot. Employees there telling Fox 5 all locations in San Diego seem to be sold out of pre-filled sandbags. I just make sure the gutters are all working and taking the water away from the property. Residents making sure things are in working order at home and preparing for flooding, which remains one of the biggest concerns. We're in a hilly area, so getting out of the house and away from the house, it's down a hill, up a hill, and everything just collects down at the main valley, and all that's going to be flooded, guaranteed. Now, as we mentioned, flooding is a concern all over San Diego, but the National Weather Service is giving extra caution to the mountains, deserts, and low-lying regions like right here in Escondido, especially if you are near a creek or a river crossing. Reporting live in Escondido tonight, Kasha Grigorczyk, Fox 5 News. And I believe there's about seven swift water rescue teams ready to go on standby because of potential events like that. Thank you, Kasha.